This video provides an overview of the operation of the Midmark M9 and M11 steam sterilizers. Always refer to the appropriate technical documentation for the complete list of instructions, safety alerts, and sequence of procedures before conducting any service or maintenance operations. Your sterilizer has four pre-programmed cycles and two programmable cycles. The programmed cycles include unwrapped, pouches, packs, and hand pieces. After verifying that the sterilizer has adequately filled with water and has been loaded properly with sterilization items, close and seal the door. Closing and sealing the door is done by lifting the door handle and pushing the door closed. Once the door is closed, gently push inward on the door while sliding the door handle downward to engage the latch. The display will show select cycle and then waits for input from the operator. To begin the cycle selection process, push the start button. The additional heat message will appear. This allows the user to preheat the unit if desired. When preheating is complete or if no preheating is desired, press the stop button to end this phase of cycle selection. Based on the type of load to be sterilized, select the appropriate cycle key. Please refer to the user guide to determine which cycle is appropriate for the load that will be sterilized. Once the cycle type has been selected, two alternating messages will now be displayed. The first message shows the name of the cycle, sterilizing temperature, and the amount of sterilizing time. After a brief pause, the second message displayed will show the type of venting to be used and the amount of drying time. If the stop button is pressed before the dry cycle, indicated by the display returning to the select cycle mode, items in the sterilizer should not be considered sterile. Once you have made your selections, press the start button to begin the sterilization cycle. The display will now show the message filling chamber, followed by chamber is full when the proper water level is reached. The unit will now begin to heat to the appropriate temperature for the selected cycle. The display will change as the temperature and pressure in the chamber changes. Once the appropriate sterilizing temperature is reached, the display shows the time countdown and monitors the temperature and pressure. During sterilization mode, the heater will cycle on and off. Just prior to the end of the sterilization cycle, ready to vent will display for 10 seconds. Then the vent cycle will begin. While the sterilization cycle finishes, the display will change as temperature and pressure in the chamber changes. An audible signal is emitted to indicate that the door is about to open. When the pressure in the chamber reaches zero, the door will partially open, beginning the drying cycle. The sterilizer will now display the amount of time remaining for the drying cycle and will count down to zero. At the end of this countdown, an audible signal is emitted for 10 seconds, indicating that the sterilization cycle is complete. After sterilization is complete, all items must be handled appropriately in accordance with all relevant processes and guidelines. Before removal from the sterilizer, it is critically important that all items and packages be completely dry. If packages are not dry, the operator may add additional drying time to the cycle as described previously. Unwrapped items should be transported immediately and aseptically from the sterilizer to the point of use. Wrapped items may also be stored in a protected storage area until they are needed. Remove trays and cassettes using the Midmark approved tray and cassette removal tool. Hold the tray level and slightly elevate it to prevent it from shifting and becoming dislodged. For more detailed information about your sterilizer, please refer to the M9 M11 user guide. For further support, contact Midmark Support Services at 1-800-MIDMARK.